<sighs> All right. Let's see. 153. Another day, another dollar. It's another week. We're still alive. We're still getting it done. So I've got to edit some videos, and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to spend a couple minutes editing, and then uh, I'll hit the base for a little bit, and then uh, I'll call it a night. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. We're fixing another problem. Okay. All right, I got that video done. I actually got it done. I got a video completely edited in one hour. That was pretty good time. All right, now. Here at 10, right? I just did a nasal spray and now my nose is all jacked up. <coughs> Winter is always dark and dreary. Hey Lana. What's up? It's been a couple days cause I, I, I had a relapse or something? I don't know. Got kind of a uh, sicky and sort of. I uh, I think uh, after Monday this week, <clears throat> I don't know. I got tightness in my chest again and kind of coughing some. Thought I might be getting it again, but I yesterday I got up and I was fine. So today I feel fine as well. At least I did. <coughs> Do I use that nasal spray? Yeah. See now my my nose is starting to clear up. Nice. There's still snow. There's still snow. Insanely, insanely cold. I think it was like, at some point this morning it was eight. So yeah, that's that's pretty cold, right? Colder than I'd like. I think it's about 40 out there right now. So it's not, <clears throat> not too, not too bad. I'm trying to figure out where my phone is. So I've got this stupid uh, ceiling fan that has a ring light. <clears throat> and I don't know if you know, but ring lights aren't very... Huh? What's up with you? What's your problem? You're being annoying. The ring light bulbs aren't very, like, widely available. So I haven't had a ceiling light in the bedroom for like a week or two. See, I had this problem before when it went out and I had to get one. But I thought... I thought I might have gotten two. Got lots of, whoa, I'm losing you. I'm losing you, you're, you're falling backwards. I got lots of bulbs and the bulb, this is the bulb drawer. Let's change this thing out. Now I got, I got some film material to work with. First things first, grab a headlamp because this, what I've learned from uh, good old Hank, it's a headlamp. Headlamp is really nice to have, especially if uh, your light doesn't work. These are relatively simple. You just unscrew these screws here, and the globe will drop. Uh huh. And here's a ring light. Okay.
Okay. Plug it in. Let's check, see if it works. Alexa, what are my notifications? Two new notifications from Amazon Shopping. Two shipments have arrived. I found two deals for items you saved on Amazon. First, from your wish list. Ruvanti 100% cotton four-piece flannel sheets full deep pocket warm. It's $39.94 after $20.05 in savings. With delivery by January 25th. To get the deal, just say, add to cart. No. To hear another deal, say, Next. Next. Last deal from your wish list. Melanie full size sheet set hotel luxury 1800 bedding sheets in Philadelphia. They're really, it's really trying to sell me sheets. After $17.40 in savings with delivery by January 25th. To get the deal, just say, add to cart. Yeah, I'm not interested. I'm always interested to hear how I can improve. Try saying, I have feedback. I have feedback. Yeah, see, it doesn't work. It doesn't always work. Alexa, turn on living room. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so it's mail time, mail time, mail time, mail time. So uh, in the mail the, this week, we've got this box and we've got those boxes, so. It's not like a crap, crap ton of boxes. It's just a couple things. So we have our immunodeficiency uh, vitamin regiment. Cat food for Lana. Lana! Yeah, she doesn't care. She's got a book to add to the, the, the stack of books. I'm not positive, I'm pretty sure that the title kind of throws the book off because I'm pretty sure that it's <clears throat> my daily vitamins. So this is uh, my multivitamins that I take. And this is something I was gonna, this is something new I'm gonna try because we don't all get all the good stuff from the greens because we don't eat enough greens in this stupid country because you can't. There's no possible way. You have to work eight to 12, 14 hours every day, and you gotta come home to a cat that messes up your house that you gotta clean, and and so you only get to uh, like make yourself two good meals a week. So we're gonna supplement right here. So we got that. That's what's in the, that's what's in the mail today. This was all the cat food that was left. That's like three days worth, maybe. Yeah, about three days. What? No, I already gave you food. No, I already fed you. It's in your bowl. You have to go there and get it. Now I've gotta take my vitamins for today because I didn't take them. I can't remember, is this? Oh, it's almost gone. Ah, it's cold. So, oh, it's like brain freeze cold. Okay, so originally I was going to have Hank do this, but I just don't, I don't. Ain't nobody got time for all that nonsense. So, what was in this box? Pretty simple. It's a book, a book, a bookshelf, a book, bookcase. Make sure you guys use your team lift to, for this box. Cause you know how, you know how you snowflakes Need the uh, government to tell you what to do. It's team lift, what a, what a joke. This thing weighs like 20 pounds. You need two people to help you with that? They should send you instructions on how to open the box. Right. 
check that out. They they put like this is taking up half the box. This is specifically for uh, DVDs and and Blu-rays and video games. It's all nonsense. Non and nonsense. No instructions. How will I know what to do? I guess I'm gonna have to go get some tools because could make it easy. Okay, since we don't have all day, hit the montage. There we are. Good old shit. Trying to figure out how I'm gonna do this because this is the top shelf. Now it can either go here, which is good for CDs. It can go here, which is good for everything else. And that's, that's pretty much it. A Blu-ray will not fit that. See, the shelf would have to be right here. So it has to go like this. So the best we're gonna do is, okay. So now I've got to put all my stuff on the thing. Come on over to my entertainment system. Look at all this. This is why I need the this shelf. What is over here? Oh, okay. I know this looks full, which it mostly is, but uh, I I did that on purpose. I actually have more than this. Which is why I needed this to start with. So I would have a place to put put all my stuff that was laying around. I'm, I'm happy. Now I'm gonna get rid of this this trash. Grabbing a couple more mail things. Mail, mail things. Things in the mail. This is my other supplement that I was waiting for. It's supposed to come with my other supplements in a dead, dead in I think this is uh, the other book that I ordered. Because me likey book. It's a book from uh, Julie Kelly. Got a couple pins. This right here is the Black Rose hat. See, this one fits better than the other one. The other one's kind of big. So the rose is supposed to go on the hat. I just want to stick it somewhere where it's not uncomfortable. I needed some more... Uh, Needs some more diversity. I really like these uh, these workman style hats though. I'm going to go to the studio because I wasn't feeling the greatest. I haven't been down here for a couple days, so yeah, everything's been shut off, and I gotta rejigger everything. Go ahead and get some uh, base practice in figure out what's going on on my computer. I think I need to upload a video to Rumble. I think I need to do that. So I'm learning this song in F. <clears throat> but I'm going to play it. In G. When you tune your guitars down like this, it's prefer it's preferable preferable. There we go. Preferable. It's preferable to have heavier gauge strings.
since we're not working in the factory today, we're working in the studio. Maybe we'll get the, uh, we'll get the, uh, the, uh, yeah. Maybe we'll get the, the trailer done today. Turning our new memories, but I figured it must be super expensive. Not at all. These paintings are really affordable. That's not really true. Expensive. Those paintings are expensive. Amazing. I want to know, where do you go? Ho, 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 hey, ho. Where do you go? Whoa, 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 hey, ho. Okay, it's been a couple days. And sometimes late at night. Sometimes oh, when I do the work thing, I don't want to do video stuff all the time. So it's been a couple days since I've recorded anything. But I come home and it smells like trash. So I'm going to get rid of this trash can, trash bag, trash receptacle. Because at the moment I only have one video uploaded. <laughs> ready to go for next week. Uh, this week is going to be a podcast, so I'm, uh, I've been getting getting that together. My book and my notes. I got a good, uh, I got a good list of things to go over this week, which is good. It's, good. it's what happens when you don't, uh, when you don't do anything for a month, right? Yeah, it was January. That, or I want to get this video done tonight. Get my notes together, and I can do the podcast. Okay, I'm gonna work on this stuff, and uh, if I do something else, I'll come back. I got a cool story. So earlier I was outside, so I was outside and I was grilling, and of course you know it's cold outside. I'm trying to stay warm, so I started a fire in my fire pit. And uh, I have uh, a I have a can of old gas that's no good, and uh, uh, so I've been using it as fire starter. I uh, I've been doing this for a while now. I've been doing this for months. I had a cup, and I put a little bit of gas in it, like I mean small amounts, because a little bit goes a long way. And then I would use that to put on the thing for the fire. Anyways, this time. I had uh, I had the the gas and the thing and the fire and this time the fire ended up jumping uh, into into the cup of gasoline when when I was like dumping it and so I'm holding a plastic cup of gasoline that's on fire and so I. Uh, what I did was I took the cup and I threw it in the fire pit. Well, some of the gas had got on my hand. And now my hand is on fire. Which I thought was kind of funny. So I just took my flaming hand and like went like this and it immediately went out because that's how fire works. I didn't freak out. Go running through the yard waving my hand going, ah! But now I have the slightest I have I have the slightest of like one degree burns on my thumb here and uh, like on my finger here. So I mean you you can't you can't tell but they're like slightly red. Oh. So yeah, that's my my hand on fire story. I'm I'm a little upset though cuz now one one short little plastic measuring cup. Okay, so I've got to uh get this memory card out. And upload some footage, so I'm gonna do that. Oh, my battery's almost dead. <laughs> uh, I have to, I have to get that fixed. Oh my gosh! Now you're too tall. So I have two trees in the yard, and uh, they're starting to get a little overgrown, more so than I'd like. Especially the one that's already grown up into the uh, electrical lines. So I'm gonna go out and uh, trim them down a bit. The winter is the best time to do this and not kill your tree. So that's what we're gonna do. And like I said, hope we don't kill our tree.